What is up, my fellow heathens? This is Heathen Skip, and I'm very big. Hi. I'm very large. And this is the most white I've worn in a long time. This is really weird for me. But it's Spider-Man. Spider-Man! All over my face, my chest, and whatnot. Anyway, um, I've been gone for uh, a couple of weeks. I haven't posted anything. Uh, not for any particular reason. Um, hold on. This is making a noise. Hey there clean out some dust. Um, but I've been looking into a lot of things that YouTube has been doing and I've been reading up on some articles that have been posted online and got a haircut. Yeah, that was a thing. How does it look? You like it? No? Don't care. Okay. Anyways. Um, <laughs> but seriously, I hope you do like it. I think I look snazzy. Um, no, but I took a little bit of time off, even from just playing video games. Uh, you know, I played Overwatch here and there. Um, you know, just some of the games that I can just easily just get into and just go and don't really have to think about. And just play them because you play them the same way over and over and over again. Um, mostly because I didn't know... If I want to continue posting stuff on YouTube, because it was it was one of those things where it's just like, am I really getting out of this what I wanted to get out of this? And for me, oh, that's really loud. I'm sorry. I am so sorry. Wow. Let's go ahead and bring those down. Um, you didn't hear anything. You didn't hear anything. See? No. Nope, didn't hear nothing. Nothing was heard. Nothing. No, you didn't hear anything. Um, but I needed I needed to take a little bit of time and, and evaluate whether or not I was getting out of posting stuff to YouTube to to have what I wanted out of it. And this kind of goes along with the whole everyone is you know freaking out about the new. Well, not really freaking out, but every, on the tip of everyone's tongue is the new um, algorithm and demonetization and the ways of getting around it and yada, yada, yada. And I got to make sure I point the level away because granted, I only have 25 subscribers or 24 or probably at this point 12. Um, apparently, a still thing that you got to say, not sponsored by anybody. It's easier just not to show any labels or anything like that. Um, but yeah. Uh, I don't care about any of that. The monetization or the demonetization. I want to play video games. I want to play the games that I play. That I like playing. I like playing horror games. I like playing FPS. I like playing... Um, first... Or... FPS, first person shooters. Uh, I like playing uh, strategy games. I like solving puzzles. I like RPGs. I like pretty much any and all games. And I want to play those. Everyone's saying that, oh no, now they're really sticking to, you know, you get more viewers and you get more uh, revenue and you get more subscribers if you play one specific game. Everyone's playing Fortnite and so everyone's getting Fortnite subscribers subscribers people are back into uh minecraft so people even people who said that they weren't going to play minecraft start, jumped on the bandwagon and started playing minecraft i'm not going to do that i don't want to do that this is what i want to do and i want to feel like that the very few people that are subscribed to this are actually watching these videos and I'm, i get to play with you guys i get to hang out with you guys because i don't really get to hang out with a lot of people anymore you know um i don't really like going out anymore. I don't like large groups of people. I, you know, a lot of people, a lot of you can understand and get behind that. I mean, it's just, it's just one of those things. It's just like, feel like a wild animal backed into a corner and you just want to start thrashing out at everybody. So this is where I feel most comfortable socializing and, you know, getting some sort of social interaction and I try and you know I've, I've pretty much responded to every single comment that's been made 
on my channel, and I appreciate all of them. The good ones, the bad ones, the ones that didn't really make any sense, the ones that made absolute sense and it just didn't click into my brain, I, I love it. You know, I love having that alternate point of view. I love having interactions. And please, if you guys have any suggestions for games, let me know. You know, if you have any recommendations for games, if you have anything that you want to add to what I'm doing to make it more entertaining for you and make it more fun for you, let me know. Because I, I want to continue making this something for us. Um, I do want to... I am going to play a game. This is not just me being a uh, psychopath and ranting and raving and, and whatnot. Um, I'm playing this game because of somebody that I spoke to, one of my newer subscribers, um, Kira. So, hi Kira, thank you. Um, I honestly forgot your name, I'm not going to lie. I'm going to be 100% with you, I forgot your name for a second there, and so I looked it up on my phone. I'm going to be honest. But keep in mind, this is how good I am with names. Um, I have a friend, uh, Mikey whom I've been friends with since he was a wee little boy and I was a slightly older wee little boy and I've known him for years and I actually played a game of Overwatch with him and recorded it and posted it and realized after the fact that I had called him Andy which is his brother's name in the video and I felt like such a huge ass but this one is for you, Kira, because I don't have any other Pokemon games. But I did find this one Pokemon horror game. Now let's just make me smaller. Uh, too small. There we go. There we go. All right. Well, I've ran into rape for about seven minutes now, so let's go ahead and get into this. Um, it, this has to do with Escape from Poke Cave. I don't know what it. I I didn't read into anything into it. It's on uh, itch.io. Um, I'll put a link in the description so that if anybody else wants to give it a shot or play it, you can play it. Um, but yeah, it just started off with, to begin, left click. And that's when I accidentally left clicked because I wanted to see if there was sound because I wasn't hearing anything. Um, but yeah, here we go. Where am I? Seems I'm still at that haunted cave. I gotta find a way to battle those ghosts. I don't know what the controls are. My Pokemon are too scared to fight them in their ghost forms. Form. My Pokemon are gone! Except for Pikachu. Hey girl, let me Pikachu. Sorry, that was cheesy. I must find my remaining four Pokemon before I leave this place. Oh, okay. Oh, there's a wall. I like how the wall texture is just the floor texture and the ceiling texture stretched out. It's actually pretty cool. Alright, so I got I got Pikachu, and I'm gonna have to fly some Pikachu's. Uh, how does that work? Okay, I was gonna say, does this let me go all the way around? Cause that would be creepy. Okay, so it is a set map, so it doesn't look like it's going to be changing or anything on me, because I was worried about that. Because with the repeating pattern all over the place, it, if they had the map change in any way, it would I, you'd get lost. You, you'd be lost forever, and you wouldn't know what to do or where to go, but it looks like a set map. I wonder if it's generated the way... Uh, I wonder if it's generated in a set way so that it's the same map every time. Oh, Pokemon! You found Chikorita! Alright, I found my Chikorita. Oh wait, am I being hunted right now? And I just happen to not find anybody? See, now I'm nervous. Now I'm freaking myself out. Did you guys hear that? Okay. Hi. How you doing? Hey, buddy. Uh, we're gonna go this way. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. I'm um, battling. A ghost appeared. Your Pokemon are scared. They're too scared to fight an actual ghost. 
you feel weak as the ghost of Varys is so- <laughs> I thought I had a fighting chance. Apparently not. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, synopsis. You wake up in a cave and s infested with Pokemon spirits that lie in unrest. And almost all your Pokemon are gone missing. Find your way out of this horror as you venture to rescue all your Pokemon. But the question is, will you be able to find your Pokemon and escape this nightmare? Or will you and your Pokemon be devoured by the spirits during this process? Okay, so you can battle. Hence, your Pokemon will die when they lose in battle. One of your Pokemon has the ability to teleport you once to the last location. Oh, teleport you once to the last location you picked up an item fleeing the battle. This game might contain some bugs. Let me know if you encounter it. Okay, so yeah, let's, let's make sure that we let them know. Let's try this again. May with unity. Okay, the haunted Pokemon cave. Take two. Left mouse to begin. Okay, so I know where Chikorita is. Come on. Come on. Maybe I should find Chikorita last. No, I know where Chikorita is, so I'll just I'll just beeline for Chikorita. Now, can they go through walls? Because that'd be creepy as oh! Okay, I found Chikorita. I'm getting very Slenderman vibes from this. Oh, I can run. Oh, look at that. Okay. Let's make this shit happen. Nope. 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 Uh, ghost scope? Your Pokemon can now identify the ghost. Oh, sweet! Okay, so I can battle. I can battle. I'm still gonna run. I'm still running. Can't catch me. Fast as fast can be, I'll never catch me! <laughs> nope, 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 nope. Oh, okay. Hunter. Uh, Hunter appeared. Okay. Uh. Let me go ahead and do Pikachu. Oh shit! Quick attack? <gasps> Pikachu, no! Tackle? Razor Leaf? Okay, okay. Razor Leaf! Chikorita's is dead. My Chikorita died. All oh, your Pokemon were killed in battle. You feel weak as a hunter. Devours your soul. <laughs> Sorry, okay. Mom! It won't get me the next time. It won't get me the next time. It won't get me the No! It won't get me the next time. I love how it just kicks you out of the game. It's like, and you're done, bitch. <laughs> See, you were trying to play, but then we're like, nope, you're done, bitch. Okay. Anywho. Uh, 
could have just made it. See, I would like this a lot more if there was some sort of alterations or changes to the map, uh, the the locations. You know, obviously this is an this is an indie game. I mean, I I paid. You know, through itch.io, I basically just paid whatever I... Crap! Okay, so I know... I know I don't have my lenses. I don't have my lenses. Can't really see shit. It's gonna kick me out. Alright, I'm gonna give this one more attempt. One more attempt. And I told you it wasn't gonna get me. Told you! You didn't believe me, but I told you. It didn't get me. It didn't get me. But if I get one more Pokemon, then I'll be happy. Okay, why can't this just be yes, and then automatically loads? This is annoying. One, two, three. Boing, boing. Okay, see, I need Chikorita because none of Pikachu's attacks were hurting the ghosts. Oh, I'm I am tryharding it like a mother trucker right now. I'm being very loud. I don't care. I don't care. I'm being loud. This is me. You're there. I don't want to play with you. I don't. I don't want to play with you. I don't want to play with you because I want to get my binoculars. So that I got hurt that Oh god they're not here they're not here Nope 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 That wasn't where they were at Nope He was over there My binoculars are over here Okay I can now identify the ghost Okay, I can't bypass him. Okay, a ghastly has appeared. So I know Chikorita has. What was it? It was uh, Razor Leaf. No? Vine Whip? Vine Whip. Shit! Shit! Vine Whip! Chikorita's dead. I'm so sorry, my Chikorita. Mi corazón. Lo siento, Chikorita! <laughs> Alright, girl, let me pick at you. Uh, 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 Iron Tail? Okay, Iron Tail works. Iron Tail works. Iron Tail. Whoa! What? No! 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 Wait, what? My my health bar was full. Did you guys see that? I found a glitch. I found a glitch. I feel weak. This is a girl as a hunter. It's like your Doki Doki Literature Club when you're playing through after Sari went MIA. And Yuri. Anyways. Um, thank you so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, hit that like button. If you didn't like it, hit that dislike button. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think. Let me know what you guys think about my thoughts earlier on in this video. And let me know if you guys want to see 
me play more of this, or if you want to play it for yourselves, please play it for yourselves, because I will beat this. I will beat this. I'm going to beat this. And let me know if you just want to see me beat it, or if you want to try it for yourselves, because I think you should try it for yourselves, because, well, frankly, this shit's fun. And developers like this, they need all the help they can get. Support indie developers, guys, because give them money for what they're creating now, and it helps them, it helps motivate them to become better and to develop more. I mean, look at Dan Salvato. The guy was making uh, Mario Maker levels before he actually finished Doki Doki Literature Club. And look how amazing Doki Doki Literature Club was. And then, recently, he just started making Mario Maker levels again because he loves them so much. And, mad respect, not a big fan of Mario Maker. Don't have the patience for it, really. Because I rage a lot. That's why I don't play a lot of rage games. Horror games I can get behind. Rage games. <laughs> I'll play them if I'm asked to. Or if somebody has to. But I do have a friend. Uh, he's commented before on videos. Uh, Super Beast. Who may want to come and join me. And I may have him play Doki Doki Literature Club. Keep in mind, I've already played all the way through. I haven't gotten all the endings because, well, frankly, I like the endings that I got, and I was happy with that. I didn't need any DLCs, I didn't need any extra content, unless it was going to give me some sort of inkling on what game was coming next. Um, But I think he would get a real kick out of it, and I think you guys would get a kick out of his reaction to it. So, please let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Super Beast, if you're watching this video, please make sure that you contact me and let me know what we can get together so you can play that. And, don't forget to subscribe, hit that bell for notifications, and you're going to be seeing a lot more of me because I have decided that this is something that I want to do, and I am getting a lot more out of it. I'm going to be a lot more energetic in the next few videos because I was so nervous about not being myself. And those of you who do know me personally know that I'm a very energetic and outgoing individual. And I'm very spazzy and sometimes witty. And overanalyze and overthink things all the time. But this music's giving me a headache, so... I'll talk to you guys later. This is Heathen Skip saying, just remember, if you can't be good, don't get caught. Later.